Yeah, yeah exactly. It's going to take a couple more days. Good morning, guys. Right now, you can see from our temperatures to start your day again in the 30s for areas north and west. You can see Sussex and Poughkeepsie. Pretty cool right now. New York City in the 40s, 46 degrees. We have Islip in the upper 40s. Times River still upper 30s right now. So another cool start to your day. We do have a few clouds out there for today, but we'll get some breaks of sunshine. But things will start to change. As you notice, take a look at this system. This will start to affect us, especially tomorrow when we see more of the way of increasing clouds as well. And we do have some rain on the way for Saturday. Saturday, but we'll talk about that in just a bit. Get through today first, shall we? Sun and clouds, that's what we do have. And another cool day, temperatures below normal, only a high of 61 degrees. We'll have more in just a bit. For now, let's head over to Marissa. The clouds, though. Some point. You do, you do. You will see the clouds for today. I know it's a cold start to your day and temperatures another day below normal. We've really been stuck in this rut where we've had temperatures that have been below normal for almost two weeks now. Caldwell, 43 degrees. We have Sussex now at 36 degrees. Tom's River, you're at 39 degrees. Look at areas up north. Monticello, Montgomery, Sloatsburg, 34 degrees. Poughkeepsie, same for you right now. Nyack, you're at 42 degrees. And around the area on Long Island, North Babylon, 43. Northport at 48 degrees. Into Connecticut, New Haven, 44. We have Westport over at 40 degrees right now. So a cold start to your day. Temperatures really not going to rebound that much. We'll get up to 61 degrees for today, whereas we should be at 70 degrees. So our satellite radar picture, Craig said it. We do have the clouds coming in for today. Let's out of this next system. This disturbance just to our south. What will happen? We'll start to see some clouds from it, and then another low will develop off it, and that will bring us some rain for Saturday. Look at that. That's going to be a pretty much a washout. 57 degrees. All right, we'll time that out for you in just a but for now, let's head over to Marissa Torres. Good morning. Good morning, Lisa. Temperature-wise, it is cold out there. We have temperatures only into the 40s right now in the city. It's just disappeared. We'll reboot that in just a second. North and west right now. Uh, you are in the 30s. So a cool, cool start, especially areas north and west, especially these dark blue areas where you can have temperatures near below freezing, below the freezing mark. Satellite radar picture like you saw in our live shots, a beautiful start to your day. We'll have the mix of sun and clouds. You'll have some increasing clouds later on this afternoon. Here's the reason why. This gets a little bit closer, some areas south and west of us today. Could see some showers from this, but that's well south and west uh, of the city for today into New Jersey. Highs for today around the area, another day below normal. We should be near 70 in the city. We're not even getting that, uh, getting close to that, especially on the island. Farmingdale, 62 degrees. Stony Brook, 61. Norwalk into Connecticut, 61. Same for Bridgeport. Areas up north, you'll see more in the way of sunshine, but still you will have those cool temperatures. Like Yorktown Heights, you're only uh, getting up to 61 degrees. Briarcliff Manor, 64. In Florida, only 62 degrees. And into New Jersey, slightly milder, but still below normal. East Brunswick, 64 degrees. Boundbrook, 66 degrees. And Freehold, 63 degrees. So if you're planning it out for today, yes, it's a cool start to the day. Temperatures will start to rise. We'll get into the 50s by 1 o'clock this afternoon. And by 3 p.m., we'll be at 61 degrees. We'll talk more about that rain coming for the weekend in just a bit. For now, let's head over to Marissa Torres and get a check-in. Job, Lisa. You, Lisa, are incredible. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. Nice to be appreciated. How do they forecast the weather for <laughs> these people? I'm telling the kids loved it yesterday at the weather day. They really, really did yesterday. Uh, temperatures right now, similar to yesterday, it is a cool start to your day. 30s in north and west of the area. Upper 40s for the city. Upper 40s for places on the island. Tom's River, ah, back down. You're at 40 degrees right now. So as far as what you see outside, it's a beautiful start to your day. You'll have that mix of sun and clouds. It'll look nice. It'll just feel cold and you'll have some clouds that'll come in later on this afternoon. Just ahead of our next system. Again, we showed you this yesterday. This boundary starting to head toward our area. We'll get some clouds from it. Areas well south and west of the city could see some light showers. So let me show it to you. We go through noontime today and there go the clouds. As you said, we start to get through your afternoon time, continuing through about 5 p.m. And this is just that area of southwestern New Jersey, the very southern tip of it. You can see we do have some showers from that. But as it starts to die down, what happens? Another low develops off of it. But Friday, you're fine. Friday you're fine. You
you just have a mix of sun and clouds, temperatures below normal once again for Friday. And here we go. We move into Saturday. This other low develops off of it, starting from areas southwest New Jersey, then start to move to areas central New Jersey, move toward the city around 7 a.m., continues through your afternoon into your evening time, 5 p.m. This is when we get that steady, heavier rain that will continue through your Saturday. So how much when all is said and done? Because remember, this rain continues through most of Saturday, and then we'll continue through Sunday uh, for the early part of Sunday as well. This goes through Sunday midnight. You can see one to two inches possible, but remember, we still have some more rain expected after 12 a.m., uh, so you can see possibly up to two inches of rain in some areas. And cooler temperatures on top of it, so you have the cool temperatures, you have the rain, you have some windy conditions as well. Not the best weekend. 57 degrees for Saturday. Sunday, 62 degrees, but here's something to look forward to. Monday, we start to rebound with our temperatures. 66 degrees. Tuesday, plenty of sunshine. Absolutely beautiful. 73 degrees. And by Wednesday, 77 degrees. All right, let's head over to Marissa Torres this morning and see how things are shaping up outside. Marissa. Uh, things are coming together pretty good, Lise. We do have a couple of incidents out there. Air 11, as you know, is just over the scene in Jersey City where we did have a pretty big vehicle fire, and that's affecting our westbound 78 track. From aboard here on the hottest morning show in all the land, Sukanya, my mother. Two, they're at the freezing mark this morning. Montgomery, you're at 33 degrees. Nyack, you're at 43. Uh, Peekskill, 38 degrees. And then going out to Long Island, slightly milder. Northport at 47 degrees, but still cool. North Babylon, 45 degrees. And up into Connecticut, New Haven at 43. And Westport at 40 degrees right now. So another cool start to the day. Temperatures will rebound, but not much. We're only getting to about 61 degrees in the city for today. Way below normal. Sky conditions look great. You'll have a mix of sun and clouds for today. We'll have increasing clouds, though, because we do have the system headed toward our area. What will happen, another low will develop off of it, and that is what will bring us the rain for Saturday. As far as today, you're fine. You have the mix of sun and clouds, but it's still cool, and look how the temperatures drop off. 59 for Friday. We get more in the way clouds, and Saturday, 57 degrees. All right, let's head over to Marissa Torres this morning. She's got some problems on your roads. Yeah, it wouldn't be a typical morning if we didn't have at least a couple of problems. Because you know what? There's not a lot of expectations here. No. You know, no, I'm like, you know, we, we got rid of our, yeah. really well got rid of our expectations. Yeah, yeah. I kind of like when there's not mm. a lot to do because yeah. I feel compelled to do it when the weather right. is delicious. Yeah. Right. And well, I feel like I can enjoy it. Is it going to be nice on, on a Sunday? Well, Sunday you'll have gradual clearing. Ah, so you have a few little showers clearing. in the morning and then we'll have some gradual clearing. Right. But it's going to be a little bit cool. But not until next week where we get to feel 70s and 80s. That feels nice. so much better. We just got to get through today. I know. Today, it looks nice out there. It just feels a little bit cool. Cool start. North and West still cool right now. But the sun is doing its job. The city's in the 50s, so is I. And also in the 50s, so feeling a little bit better out there. Just won't warm up too much more. Uh, satellite radar picture right now. Beautiful sky conditions out there. We'll have some increasing clouds, though, ahead of this disturbance just to our south. So just keep that in mind for today. And as far as going for the next three days. So, yes, today 61 degrees. Then we have this slight downward trend, 59 degrees, where we have mostly cloudy skies ahead of another system. Another low develops off of that. And bring some rain for Saturday, 57 degrees. We'll have much more in just a bit. For now, let's head over to Marissa Torres. All right, Lisa. At 831 right now, we're continuing to keep an eye on the roads. And some here is going to take a little toss and see if it goes. Okay, ready? Here you go, girl. Catch it. Pressure. Yeah! <laughs> That's my girl. But don't throw it. <laughs> She's got an arm. All right, let's get to Marissa Torres this morning and see how your roadways.